Hello, I'm Carlos with MIT USA. Welcome to my introduction of how to create a program on our Mega One controller. This is our Mega One controller. To the right side, we have our manual switches, torch up and down position, travel, forward and reverse, wire forward and reverse, increment and decrement buttons for while toggling in program mode. We have weld parameters and setup parameters. Setup parameters is going to have gas purge, the mode of welding, GMAW or GTAW, automatic torch control, torch height tracking, you have the ability to turn off drive motors, travel, upload tracking data, reverse weld direction, uh, insert a start position. To change any of these settings, you press select and hit the increment or decrement button. To save that, you press select again. You can enter an unload position. This is going to tell you the position of the encoder. Weld simulate. Reset home position. This is going to let you travel to home position without releasing the pressure fingers. If we go back and look at our welding parameters, this is going to have the settings of the project you're going to run. You have pre-purge time, your start conditions, amps, and the start delay time. This is after you strike an arc, it will sit above there for this amount of time your travel speed your volts and upslope time is going to be the time it takes to get to from start to run conditions press select if you would like to change that and select to save it again this is our run conditions runtime amps travel speed volts and a run weld time we're currently in manual mode so we can leave this at zero. If you'd like to add a tapered for heat control, the tapered delay time, downslope time, it'll wait this amount of time to get from run conditions to end conditions. And we have your end conditions, your end amperage, travel speed, volt, end delay time, and pose purge. We have also here the options for pulse, your pulse frequency, the duty cycle, background amperage, background travel percent, and as they say, you press select if you would like to change any of these values using increment and decrement to change it and select to save again. You can enter a weld length. Again, we are in manual, so I could leave this at zero. And to save the schedule, you simply press select and select the schedule you would like to save and select again to save. You can also adjust here the jog travel speed. That is the speed for the manual control here. And then to select the schedule, press select using increment and decrement to change it and select again to select. And that's how you create a, a program. Thank you for joining me on our video of our Mega One controller. If you have any questions, please visit us at matusaproducts.com.